Hey guys! I was just gonna sit down and do some menu planning for the week. Uh, we just moved into a new house and previously we'd been living with my in-laws and so this is something that's sort of new to my planning routine. Um, so I kind of wanted to show you how I do it. It's not too complicated but um, here it is. In my long-term collections insert here in my traveler's notebook, I um, have started sort of just a list of recipes. This is basically a list of everything that I have cooked since we moved in um, that went well. And so uh, it's sort of just to jog my memory and give me kind of an idea of um, what I can add to my uh, schedule for the week if I need to, or if I don't have any ideas off the top of my head. Uh, the way I've been doing the actual planning schedule has been either in a list like this on my weekly or you have just like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. Like I only had one thing here for the weekend. Um, probably could have had two that weekend, I forget. I think I ended up getting a take and bake pizza for Sunday. Um, and then just kind of crossing it out as I go. And the weekend or the week after that. I put the menu on here above Monday, same way though. Um, this week, I didn't leave room on the weekly for it or at the top of Monday, so I'm gonna put it on this side. And I think this week, instead of putting a, um, a list across, I'm gonna put a list down because uh, that way I don't have as uh, tight of an amount of room. So let's take a look at that. So I've gone ahead and left Sunday blank for now. Um, I think I'll probably find or think of something as we go through the week and, um, and add that to the list later. I never really know so far, like our weekend is pretty sparse, um, but I feel like that might change. And so that would change our plans here as well. Um, I have, let's see, this one here, we're gonna go to the church. Here we're going to my in-laws house and then on Tuesdays we eat leftovers because that's the night that we're busy um, so I already have the stuff I need for this so I just need to get ingredients for this and for this and this one I actually have to look up a recipe online because I want to try a new recipe that I haven't tried before so I'm gonna do that real quick and then we'll come back and we'll make the grocery list all right, so I found the recipe I'm looking for and I um, went ahead and I just bookmarked it to a folder in my Chrome um, of recipes that I'm saving to try or that I've tried and don't wanna lose. Um, so it's there for when I need it on Saturday. Um, but then in the meantime, I just need to write down my actual shopping list. So I just used this uh, notepad that I got from Universal Studios. It's got the Ministry of Magic logo on it and it makes me happy. I keep this on the fridge because it has um, magnets on it. And so, you know, whenever you need something, you can jot it down. Um, but I also just, you know, bring a sheet of this with me to the grocery store. So uh, let's see, I'm just gonna write down everything I need for both of the recipes and then a couple other things just, you know, that we need staples.
And I think that's everything for now. I will just be taking this with me to the grocery store later today. And then um, as I go through the week, I'll just cross off the, uh, the meals as we eat them and make them. Um, that way, at the end of the week, if something changes with the plans um, and we don't end up cooking one of the, the recipes that I was planning on cooking, then I'll know that we still have the ingredients for that and I'll move it to the next week and make sure we eat it then. Um, and X just means that it's all dealt with and not a problem. So that's kind of how I do it, um, though I, like I said, just moved into the new house and just started doing this meal planning thing at all. So I'm definitely looking for suggestions. So tell me in the comments, um, how do you do your meal planning? Do you use your bullet journal or do you use just an online uh, resource? Do you use any special tools? Where do you find your recipes? All of that good stuff. I'd love to hear any sort of tips you have because, you know, I'm just starting, starting out with this household running idea, so. Um, Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I post videos three times a week, so I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.